IBS is the leading corporate responsibility network in Finland. We have been promoting uh, socially, uh, financially and environmentally responsible business since 2000. We have already 200 members. We created this originally the whole company based on the idea of working in this context of social responsibility with actually plan as the first client for which we developed the solution. The, the original requirement is that NGOs like PLAN, they do development uh, improvement efforts in many developing countries and it's very difficult for them to follow what's actually going on in the field, what the impact of the programs are, how they should prioritize issues in different areas. So we created a mobile tool for them to enable them to follow and get data from the field to the office to help them in, in managing and planning their development programs. Our solution is now impacting, for instance, in Africa, a better understanding about sanitation and improvement needs in schools in rural areas, which is often a big challenge, especially for girls in, in, in remote areas uh, attending schools. And then in the Asian, several Asian countries, it's now helping to get more information about the status of patients and what kind of health treatment they need. For us as a company, this has been a first step and we are now expanding with similar solutions approaches also for commercial areas. So this has helped us a lot in, as a company to get started. We wanted to create a bridge to employment for disadvantaged individuals by leveraging our core competencies in partnership with our clients uh, the public sector and non-governmental organizations. MAPA Group offers a cost-effective service for salary-subsidized temporary staffing. The candidates that we present to our clients fulfill their search and competence criteria and are entitled to publicly financed salary subsidies. Our service includes the entire recruitment process as well as all the administrative work related to salary subsidies. All our partnerships increase employers' awareness of equal opportunities. The cooperation also focuses on the range of services and solutions which help connect people with work. As a result, we have succeeded in finding employment and future prospects for hundreds of individuals. In addition, we have managed to raise the importance of diversity issues both in businesses and the society. At Nokia we started to work with environmental issues already at early 90s and this is a long-term commitment for us and we wanted to get an external expertise to have a discussion and to learn from each other so we partnered with WWF already at 2003. We worked together to decrease the environmental impact of Nokia operations. We done a lot of awareness raising both internally and externally. Externally, we arranged uh, take-back campaigns for obsolete mobile devices and then also provided mobile content to uh, mobile phones for consumers to learn more about environmental issues. Then we also certified our Nokia head office to WWF Green Office program. The partnership has had positive impact both to both the people and planet. So the environmental impact of Nokia's own operations has decreased. We have learned from each other during the partnership a lot and then hopefully in the end people who are using Nokia devices can also decrease their own personal environmental impact by using the services and applications in the product. This kind of award brings positive visibility for the collaboration of companies and their stakeholders. We were delighted to see that Finnish companies had already developed innovative and profitable solutions to these social problems. Interestingly enough, Many of them included uh, mobile technology solutions. We expect more and more companies to take this path. Successful business in the future means to create solutions for environmental and economic problems. Based on companies' positive interest and feedback, we would like to continue this award also next year.